Hi, welcome to Professional Certifications Channel. Let's break down CPHU exam prep, one topic a day for focused and effective learning. Today's topic is Structure Measures in Healthcare. Structure Measures in Healthcare. Structure measures play a critical role in healthcare quality assurance by focusing on the environment and resources within which healthcare services are provided. They reflect the capacity, systems, and conditions necessary for delivering high quality care. Definition Structure measures assess the healthcare settings environment and the capacity in which providers deliver care. They focus on the infrastructure necessary for patient care, including physical facilities, equipment, staffing, and organizational characteristics. Details 1. Components of structure measures Facilities and equipment, the adequacy and condition of physical facilities and the availability of necessary medical equipment and technology. Staffing, measures related to healthcare personnel, such as nurse-to-patient ratios or staffing levels in various departments. Qualifications of healthcare providers, the training, certification, and qualifications of healthcare professionals, including the percentage of board-certified clinicians. Financial resources, the availability of operational funds and resources for patient care and facility maintenance. 2. Importance in Healthcare Foundational for Quality Care the structure forms the foundation upon which care quality is built. Inadequate facilities or staffing can hinder the delivery of high-quality care. Patient safety and care quality. A well-structured environment enhances patient safety and the overall quality of care provided. Resource allocation. Structure measures help in identifying areas where resource allocation may need to be improved or increased. Compliance and standards. These measures ensure that healthcare settings comply with regulatory standards and best practices. 3. Examples of structure measures Nurse to patient ratios, indicating the number of nurses available to care for patients, which can impact patient outcomes and staff workload. Certification of staff, the proportion of staff with specific qualifications or certifications, which can influence the level of care expertise. Technology and equipment availability, the presence of essential medical equipment, such as MRI machines, which is critical for accurate diagnosis and treatment. Facility accreditation, whether a facility has been accredited by recognized bodies, indicating adherence to certain standards. 4. Challenges and considerations. Investment requirements, upgrading and maintaining structure components can be costly and require significant investment. Rapid technological changes. Keeping up with rapidly advancing medical technologies and equipment can be challenging. Balancing cost and quality. Finding the balance between cost effectiveness and the provision of high quality, resource intensive care. Regional variabilities. Structural needs and capabilities can vary significantly based on the region and the population served. Conclusion. Structure measures are fundamental to ensuring that healthcare settings are equipped to deliver high-quality care. They provide a tangible assessment of the resources, staff, and environment that form the backbone of healthcare delivery. While investing in and maintaining these structural aspects can be challenging, they are essential for ensuring patient safety, care quality, and the overall effectiveness of the healthcare system. If you found this content informative, Please like, share, and subscribe.